All right, guys, so this is what's going on right now. I'm buying JD's IS300 rims. These are actually the Mazda 6 rims, but they were on his car. And so I'm buying them for a good deal. The reason why, because they're super lightweight. They just weigh just over 15 pounds. So that makes them perfect ideal for drag racing. Since I'm going Wednesday to Sacramento, they're perfect. We're gonna wait another hour. We're gonna go get his car, take the rims off, and then put them on and hopefully be ready by then. I got two days and it's 104, 105 degrees outside. So yeah, we'll keep you guys updated. Pero me dice que en esas ahorita no tenía. Pero ahorita ya tengo. All right, guys. So JD should be on his way right now. We're gonna take the rims from the IS300 and then put my new rim and tire setup in the back. That way, I have 16s and 16s. Take these and put them in the front. By the way, I'm missing a lug nut. I don't know if you guys can see that. Missing it right there. I just changed the oil. I'm sure you guys saw that video about, what was it, two, maybe two, three weeks ago. Change the oil on it, get that ready. I got the tire, the rim set up, the ones I wanted. I'm going with 16s because I don't want much rim. I have 17s on, drag DR19s. I want lightweight 16s, which are what these are, and then I'm gonna go with the 225, yeah, 225, 45, 16. Yeah, I think it's 225, 45, or they're 225, 50, 16. I don't remember, but they're wide enough. I hope I get some traction with that. And so these, I'm probably, I'm not gonna have time, but I'm gonna have to find some tires. Since these are 16s as well, maybe I'll take these Falcons out and put them on here yeah maybe we'll see what happens that's the thing with the car scene there's just so much to do you don't know what you're going to be doing next it's one thing or another everything is just so not complicated it's just there's always so much to do there's always so much options um so this is going to be my my daily and I'm getting a phone call. It's him. What's up, JD? So he wants me to go get the other rims. Um, the other ones on his ICE 300, the ones we mounted the tires on. He wants me to go get them so we could put them on his car and then put the rims and tire he has there, which I bought on my car. Ah, oh, sh. Here he is again. What's up, JD? All right, so this is his setup. He's running stock IS300 rims. They're 17s. And he just got the no brand tires, but they're 245s by 45, 17. So nice and wide for the back. I don't know why he's going with 245s. I told him 235s is good enough, but you know him, he does whatever he wants so that's cool with me it's all good there he is JD, yours came out clean. Got some thick tires though. Some wild tires.
take it off this one? No, no. you didn't. Oh, we got to take it off. So this is the one. You guys can see that. Then they fit on these, but they don't on the Mazdas. So remember to take this off. I'm going to need these. Alright. I'm going to put this on the Mazda. That way, I can take my other rims, my Motegis off, and swap them. So now I got it on a jack already and I'm just going to do the same thing now to this side. Got my Motegis out. How long? Maybe a minute or two? So it's getting dark right now and I don't want you guys... You're not going to be able to see anyway, bad quality. But regardless, if not tonight, tomorrow, I'll go ahead and show you. And I'll give you guys an update on what's going hey on. Hey everybody, welcome back. I finished my setup for Sacramento. I got my 16s front and back with my 225s, 50, 225, 50, yeah, 16s in the back. Here it is. The car is almost done. All I need is to take the back spare out and wash the car. And I'm all set. I'm ready for Sacramento. So here's my Motegis. And there are the Mazda rims, nice, lightweight, and so I just got the original stock ones on the Mazda. So there it is, all I gotta do now is get the spare out. By the way, I don't recommend doing this unless you have some type of fixer flat or inflator like this, you can get this at Amazon, O'Reilly, AutoZone, pretty cheap. So if you're gonna take your spare out, make sure you have some backup plan. I really, again, do not recommend this. Okay. By the way, I do have a lightweight spare. And so this is it. It came in the Mazda. So I'm gonna be using it for my car, just not for the racing. I'm gonna wash it, it's super dirty. But I really like it, the new setup. It's pretty nice. Catch you guys later, guys. Gotta get ready, bye. And I hear there is a lot of cops exactly here. You know why? Yeah, be careful because they're gonna pass you out for that kind of thing. They do that.